So I just picked up my phone and had a notification from Apple News Alerts asking me if I have low testosterone. But enough about my problems. Let's see how Ford crawlers. Whoa, what the fuck? Oh, oh, I didn't like that. I didn't like that at all. Oh, I wasn't. I thought like I'd get halfway up here and then start sliding backwards, and I was meant to actually platform out or something. And, and then, and then maybe I do have low testosterone. I can't handle shit. I have a breakdown at the smallest of fucking issues. Whoa, 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 whoa. steady on. Steady on there, lad. Okay, I didn't, I didn't realise it would come back up again. Maybe that's on me. Let's go full speed away then. I'm assuming touching any of the walls is going to be a bad time for me. Didn't even see that figment, but I picked it up anyway. I see that one though. Uh... Oh, fuck's sake. Probably should have deballed at that point, shouldn't I? Should have unballinated. There's a figment over there as well. I'm seeing them now. I'm feeling their vibes. They're calling out to me from every corner of the map. Joe, they say, come, come save me from my my prison. My my prison of self-imposed solitude. Halfway up this weird barber shop hair tower. And I say, anything for you, Mr. Figment. That's what I say. Wait a minute. You're not Lucy. It is such a relief to hear you say that. You're something I... from deep inside her. Can't dismount something the ladder. dangerous we accidentally unlocked. <sighs> Nor can I jump off here. Well, they really don't want me going on that particular section of the lighthouse. Crazy. Here I am again. I've clearly missed figments, but I think I know where they are. They were right back at the start before I realised how the uh, the hairdryer mechanic worked. Oh well, I'll get them when I do hey, the clean up later. Mike, how'd you get in here? Don't push me. I'll gargle a whole bottle of hydrocyanide if I need to. I'd love to see that actually. Lucretia went to Grulovia. She went back to protect her family, to help her country. Oh, but it changed her. War changes everybody. Inside all of us, we all have dark roots. Well, sometimes we need that darkness to survive. Careful. Sometimes it's hard to get it back in the bottle. I completed the mirror, why did nothing happen? Rasputin. Agent Crawler, how do you feel? I've done a terrible thing. And so have you. But we just wanted to undo what Maligula did to you. Maligula didn't do this to me. That's the first thing I've learned in here. The rest, you're gonna have to see for yourself. Presumably he did it to himself. As a defense mechanism. I don't know, maybe there's more to it than that. Ford, what is it? See for yourself. Stop saying that, that's not helpful. Just explain, use your words. Another brand spanking new area. Only 20 figments in this one though, so uh, probably going to be a short one. I don't like that this is a graveyard. What did he do? Who did he murder? Who did he murder? What murder happened? On the Fordiant Express. That was a stretch. I feel like I could probably attack these gravestones, get some loot out of them, but I'm trying not to be disrespectful. Oh, hello. Uh-huh. I want this though. It's not coming that fast. It might gain speed though. I refuse to miss a figment. Oh, I was meant to have gone in there, huh? Agent Crawler, I'm getting less sure I want to see this. 
Oh no, I don't think you'll want to see this at all. This game gonna get darker. It was dark enough, thanks. There was the whole genocide thing. Uh -huh. <laughs> no reason to scream, you're falling quite gently and slowly. Right, aim for this first platform. Is it going to be like a series of little uh, moments that, w that we collect on the way down? Knock knock. Oh, the bowling alley. We know this place. This is where it all began. Hey Ford, what's the deal with the Deep Six treatment? I did what I had to do. I loved her after all. Wait, what? Someday when you fall in love, you'll understand. What did he do? Did he like intentionally fuck up the rest of the, the Six? In order to stop them stopping her or something. I don't know, I'm, I'm just hypothesizing here. And I'm not great at that. I need a lore video to explain this game to me. Ooh, it's a ghost. Spooky. Ford, what's going on here? What did you want me to see? I couldn't let her go free. She was a danger to the world. Even though it was the world that made her dangerous. Lucretia? Where is she? Safe. She's safe. Well, she was. But we all were. <laughs> Not anymore. Hmm. Unclear. Hopefully will become clear in time. Currently unclear though. Oh, I wasn't expecting to be able to stand on that little rock knobble. Oh, there's a thing on the shark. I want the thing on the shark. Is this the... Is the more... There is more down here. Yeah. I was kind of expecting this third one to be the end for some reason, but I think we're going to have an opportunity to keep dropping. So I can check out what's going on with that shark. Look, Ford, whatever I'm supposed to know, just spit it out. I had to hide her from the world because they'd never forgive her. And I had to hide her from me because I'd never forget her. Where? Where did you hide her? She's with family. So... I was under the impression that she was dead and she was being brought back or something, but is it that she's not? She's not actually. She moved the shock to us. Uh, is, is it that she's not actually dead and that fraud. F fraud? Fraud? Ford has, like, locked her away somewhere and she's being set. Dude! Come on now. I was waiting for you to swim by so I could jump on you and then you had to be like that about it. I'm sure that was strictly necessary, was it? Do another pass. Go on, do another one. I dares you. Okay, I can't actually jump on it. It's actually a bad thing. Hmm. I want that tag. I really want that tag, and I will jump at this shark as many times as it takes to achieve it. If I get to, like, this angle, then yep. perhaps I can... First tag. That's what I wanted. Right, moving on down. No more anything on the way down, is there? It's just straight to the bottom now. <laughs> just trying to land on those little rocks, but... Game's not super keen on me doing that. <laughs> no, 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 not again! A grave within a grave. What's this Kill Bill shit? I'm gonna have to one finger death punch my way out of the fucking casket. Oh. Oh, okay. That was unexpected. My perspective was warped a little bit there. <laughs> Uh, 
Uh huh. Skeleton bed. Huh. Who's that? Skeleton bed. That's your grandparents, Laszlo and Marona. They drowned in the Valermo Dam disaster, remember? What? No! Grandpa Laszlo died there, but Grandma made it out and came to live with my father. No, Raz. She didn't. Ford, I just saw her today. Oh. No, you didn't. Oh. Raz's grandmother is molecular? Is that what... Why would... That's far too much of a coincidence, surely, that... Because... Rasputin, after the fire burst, With Maligula? She was defeated, but alas. I That's it. Away from the others I think I've collected every figment in this mine. Yeah. And he hid her in plain sight with the circus, which just happened to be Raz's grandmother. That... I put her in the astrobane, one of Otto's inventions. Created to make permanent alterations to the psyche. And I used it to isolate and neutralize the part of her psyche that was. a murderer? Problematic. And I had my Lucy back. Ah, yes. A lobotomy. The only way to get your true love back. I knew the world would never forgive her, so I had to hide her somewhere safe. Where, Ford? Oh no. I hid her among her family, Rasputin. Among your family. Oh shit! No, no, no! Wait. No, I'm confused I now. memories and feelings on your father so he would accept her. Except Maligula? Yes. As your grandmother. No! I don't know why he said among her family, because he's already said that Raz's true grandmother died. So it's not her real family. I guess it's her adopted family, but it was a weird turn of phrase, to put it that way. <laughs> Let me go! Listen, Raz. I know you're mad. My great aunt killed my grandma. And so you made us babysitter for 20 years? Now look at it. Oh, wait, what? this news on your family now, their memories will unravel, and there's no telling how they'll react. So? They might try to kill her. If Did... Lucretia is attacked, if she feels the need to defend herself, that dark spirit could reawaken inside her. Maligula really could rise again. You're right to be mad, Rasputin. I was young. I made a terrible mistake. But we need to deal with that after we get control of this incredibly dangerous situation. She's not there. Probably wandered off into the woods again. She keeps doing that. I know where she's going. The psychonaut started out here, in the heart of the forgetful forest. There's a compound deep in these woods, protected from intrusion by psychic devices, traps, and illusions. I think Lucy's trying to get in, trying to go home. Remember, mad later, mission first. Now stick close. I'll show you how to get through. Did we know that Lucretia was Raz's great aunt? Had that been mentioned at any point in the game prior to this? Did did I miss it? Was it a rhombus of ruin thing? Like I I do not remember them ever saying that, but it's just sort of been accepted as a thing we knew. Looks like you lost him in the woods. Oh no, he's here. Wow. It's really all still here. 
the Great Needle Gulch. So much history here. I mean, this is where you assembled the team that would become the Psychonauts. This is where you first discovered Cytanium. Where Otto made his first psychoactive devices. Where Cassiopeia wrote her books. Where Helmut Colbert workshopped his psychodicy. Bob Zanotto and Compton Bull pioneered communication with plants and animals. And where... where... I mean, this is where it all began. No, Raz. This is where it all ended. It can be both. How the f... What? Is this like a place we can get to in the... I mean, we are in the real world again now, right? We did... We're not in Ford's brain anymore. I think. So is this a place we can... We can't leave now. They need my help here. It's the place we can like get to normally, like under normal human circumstances. Or is that why it made that big song and dance about not going into Ford's brain in the barber shop? Because we can't go back from here. This is the new world now. Oh, oh, oh. Well, that was an accident. This is why I shouldn't go everywhere on my levitation bubble. Sometimes I should just walk. Sometimes I should just accept that I'm going to move a little bit slower. <laughs> Not slower, I guess. Not slower. Um. Um. All right, I'll work it out. Give me a second. I'll get there. Good enough. Good. Oh fuck! What? <laughs> that got me real good. <laughs> Was not prepared for that at all. I think I could just jump to that. It looks kind of doable. <laughs> Look, your jumping puzzle. I'm gonna do it on the way back though. Now that I know these platforms sink. Oh shit! I can't get up from here. Wait. <laughs> Flawless execution. Another card over there. This is the way we're supposed to go. So let's go get the card first, real quick. Real quick. See a little little card-based detour. No, stop swinging. Just get up on it. Ooh. Hello. What's over here? There's more. There is more to be seen. One of them weird, curvy psychonaut ladders. They really like them in this game. Uh, can I not climb this? <laughs> Thank you. Oh, it's just back up to the top. I just didn't realise that was an option. Alright, around again we go then. Was that because I couldn't have gotten back? I feel like I could have gotten back. Ooh, 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 steady on. So, what is the big purple dome? How did she get over here? Beauty, what are you doing here? Do you know where you are? What can you tell me about this place? I... Oh, I think... I think I used to keep the cinnamon over there. Oh, we don't have much time. Her old memories are coming back. What's going to happen? Listen, Raz. This compound? We got into some pretty far-out stuff here. I've read about... The kind of stuff they don't write about in true psychic tales, okay? We all pushed each other to go farther, to broaden our consciousness, to open every closed door in our minds. It made us defenseless, psychically. But we were in a safe place here. We had each other. Then her homeland was attacked. She insisted on helping. I begged her not to go in that condition. It's so vulnerable. Ah, war brought something out in her that should have been locked away. 
Maligula. After the deluge, I brought her back here and closed those doors again with Maligula on the other side. How? With the astrolabe. A powerful tool we developed to make alterations to our psyches. That doesn't sound safe. Now you wouldn't understand. It was an age of exploration. But you're right. We were messing with powers we didn't understand. And now I have to clean up this mess. But I'm not the psychonaut I used to be, Rasputin. I need your help. What do you need me to do? First, I need you to go to the Heptodome and prepare the astrolabe. Well, I stay here and keep a close watch on her. Be right back, Nona. Away from the river, booty! Aha! I knew I had some chewing tobacco hidden in here. The whole Raz's family being afraid of water makes a lot of sense as well, considering she literally drowned large amounts of people. <laughs> Seems like maybe the origins of that are not as quite as clear as we thought they were either. Hmm. Um. Yeah. I see now. Everybody is bad. <laughs> Everybody is naughty. And, uh... It's down to the child to clean up the mess, as always, because that's what the child does. There's something up there. No, it's just a light. I thought there was, a, there was an item at the top there for a second. I need to go through here. Excuse me. Excuse me. Can I... Oh, I already had it equipped. Look at that. I was prepared. Makes a change for me. I don't quite know where I'm going, but I'm going. Uh, probably here wasn't the goal after all. But that's probably how it gets you. Don't think I could have made it round from that side, so we have to go this direction. Oh no, this looks even worse. How do I get over there? There's also something over there. Fucking no clue how to get there. <laughs> That's absurd. That's just silliness. Okay, hold up. Oh, fuck. Drown me. I want to be reset to the top. I don't want to make land. Thank you. Hey. So where is forwards? That is backwards. So by process of elimination. We go this way. Leave the old lovebirds to get down to some nasty, nasty business. I mean, just because she's heavily brain damaged doesn't mean that they can't still do things like that. Doesn't really bear thinking about them. This place is cool. A stained glass look to it. It's neat. This is where the first psychonauts met. And this must be. Uh huh. It's just two big drills and a laser. Don't really want that operating on me. That's it. Just astrolabe yourself. What could possibly go wrong? Well, those are thick and thorny. Burn them. That's the thing you do. Uh oh, it's Bee Lady. Bee Lady. Bee Lady's back. Okay, I'm gonna need a little help here. I knew we wouldn't have seen the last of her. Wait, is Bee Lady not back? Is it just some bees? That can't be right. Bee Lady is definitely back. This is definitely Bee Lady's doing. What if I just leave? <laughs> what if I just have nothing to do with this? Can't leave this card lying around. And there's so many delightful things. Delightful things and that. There's so many delightful things and that about. Life has a way of humbling me whenever I try and say anything about anything. <laughs> Can I not get up there? That looks like a, a potential way onto the roof. I don't know why I'd want to be on the roof, but, you know, this is a collectathon. There's almost certainly secrets hidden in every corner. What if we went from this direction? 
And just experiment for a minute, alright? Give me this. Not everything has to be about the plot. Fuck. Okay. Jump to here. Jump. Hover. Alright, fine. You win this round, Psychonauts. What's in the outhouse? Sweet, sticky beans. Look at hmm. There's a narrow slot, but I don't think I can fit through it. Another one of those needing to clairvoyant something through a small opening and I don't know how to do that sort of uh, sort of puzzles there. I never really understood those mechanics. I know I was taught it like back in the tutorial of the game basically but it didn't really work that way. I just possessed the mouse and it I just possessed the mouse and it, it just did its thing. I didn't have to like herd it or anything but when I try and herd them they just bounce off the opening so I don't really know what what I'm doing wrong. The fuel mobile needs a tuna and a car wash. And actually it smells like there's a skunk family living in there, so never mind. Oh, I've just three cards oh, around here. Please Not complaining. Yep. Is this anything over here? <laughs> Thought I'd miss that one, didn't you? You thought I wasn't the thorough explorer that I am. Seems to be an up. There's a tree house. I don't know how to. Ah, oh, maybe I do know how to. Maybe I do know how to. Well, there is a card over in that direction. Let's grab that real quick. I don't know if there's anything beyond. I don't know if that's even an area I can go to or if I'll get reset if I fall down into the... the purple. Uh, well, I can place my bets on who lives up there, can't I? Something on the roof, but I don't know how to uh, how to get to the roof. No, 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 Raz, no, bad Raz. There's no. I kind of expected there to be a way up through the ceiling at this, but there isn't. Can't believe there's no point coming here. It took a small amount of effort to achieve this. I deserve a reward for Oh, hold up. <laughs> oh, I can be a rat dipshit sometimes. Two cards. Two cards are my reward. Double card, double the fun. I mean, maybe two cards are my reward. Hmm. I feel like I need to turn this on. Oh, hold up. I've had an idea. That was risky, but look at me go. Now, this isn't a proper fireplace, is it? I thought maybe if I lit a fire in here, it would make steam come out the vent at the top. Doesn't look that way, though. I mean, I guess I can... No harm in trying, right? No, okay. I'll go back up and just take a blind leap at it, but I don't think I can don't think I can make it up to that card yet. I think I'm missing a key ability. Yep. Yeah, okay. Well you can't blame a guy for trying. Well you can, but that's not very nice. Bee smoker is private properly. P properly? Properly. Not for trespassers. Definitely says properly. Not responsible for death by bees. Good. Good. I wouldn't want it any other way. Um. Okay. Do I burn the bees? 
I don't burn the bees, turns out. Okay. Interesting. We need to learn some anti-bee techniques, I think. The ancient strategies passed down by our bee-fighting grandfathers. Was there? There's a card over here that I just completely missed. That's pretty fun. Oh, there's also an upgrade station. Welcome to the automatic. Get it? It's like automatic, but his name's Otto. Can just about. No, that's not how I do that. Can just about afford. Uh... Let's combine that psychor with your card so you can rank up. Hooray! I haven't been spending my upgrade points in a while, but that doesn't mean I'm not going to get them anyway. Still can't really afford. If you have the chain blast upgrade, this will track on more links. Oh, that's nice. And just take more damage from Psy Blast. That's not bad, actually. I'm too low level for these. Keeps you from getting encumbered by gooey doubt droppings. Deal more damage, but take more damage is dangerous. Yeah, I think I'll just get this. That's just a, a flat upgrade. I have to swap it for something. Uh, I'll, I'll swap my green ball out. I don't think that's super useful. Back to the orange ball. That's fine. I can live with that, I suppose. There's a brain tumbler here. Hmm. Is it time to take a spin in the brain tumbler? Actually... I don't want to go to the collective unconscious right now. That's not how I progress in the game, though. I know that for sure. Burn the bees. I'm not touching that thing again until I get rid of the bees and vines. And how do I do that? Precise. There's another card there. How am I this blind? <laughs> impressive. Genuinely impressive. Go back to Ford, maybe he'll have some idea of what the fuck we're meant to do. Oh, there is this area we've just completely ignored, apparently. But there's clearly quite a lot of shit we've completely ignored. Let's explore some of the stuff we've completely ignored. What's a psycho isolation chamber doing out here? What's a lever doing out here? What are two levers doing out here? Nope, that's not right. Oh, okay. Uh, pink, orange, purple. It's orange, I think. So, wait, what? Oh, it's really hard to tell with this lighting. I think it's that one. That one. That one. Hooray! What lieth within? The key to defeating bees, maybe? Or some suspicious fluid dripping from a ceiling? Wow. This must be the first ever psycho isolation chamber. Created as therapy, later used to punish kids at summer camps. Yeah, that was pretty messed up. That was a thing in the first one. All games a bit messed up, though. To be fair, it's kind of hard to say which one of the t the two games is is darker. Really, this one has like broader, more adult themes and stuff, I guess. Um, but the first one just had a lot of really like genuinely dark and edgy moments in it. So look at all the exotic animals. This must be where Compton kept his menagerie. Ah, the old Compton menagerie. I'll pretend I know what that is. Card. Hello there. Didn't think I'd miss you, did you? Give me that bling. There's some beavers and shit.
They seem to be doing alright for themselves. Oh, I was kind of hoping I could grab that leaf, but I guess not. I feel like this water is not going to be more than maybe waist deep at the worst. If Raz could drown in that, he's genuinely impressive. He's like an expert at drowning. Uh, is that everything here? No, it's not. I see you up there. How do I get to you? I think I know how I get to you. I think I can piece it together. Can we get up from here, maybe? No, we gotta go, go all the way. That's fine. I don't mind. Hooray! Uh, probably want to go off the leaf, don't we? Don't know if I would have been able to walk much further along that, that tree branch or not. And the ground rail does what now? Not a lot, apparently. <laughs> cool. Uh, what's in this direction, then? Some ropes can be cut with Cyblast. Thanks. That's the world's latest tutorial in a video game. <laughs> Fucking 12 hours in or whatever I am and it's now teaching me things. I wonder if there's anything I've missed that I could have done that with earlier in the game. Oh well. Too late for coulda. See a card in a slightly awkward. Oh fuck! 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 I didn't know that would. Oh. Oh. Well, I guess that all worked out. <laughs> Can I just walk up and get the other one from the back as well? Yeah. <laughs> well, my panicking really paid off. <laughs> Never seen that happen before. Sometimes all you want to do is just panic your way to victory. So if I drop back down here, I can then wrap around and go the intended route. Glorious. There's a spring down there as well, which has got to take me somewhere. So much to see, so much to do. Okay. I figured I could do that, I just hadn't actually tried yet. And now I know. Now I've learned. What is this Jack and the Beanstalk bullshit? Where am I going? Ooh, hello. Psycard. Psycard with a vengeance. How long has that been boiling? 20 years or whatever, someone left the stove on. Electricity bills have to be through the roof. Oh, maybe there's someone here. Hello. Agent Zanato? Bob? Hey, that just missed me. Well, his aim ain't what it used to be. Could give somebody a concussion. Yeah, well, it was your choice to come in here <clears throat> uninvited. Yeah, it's dangerous in here. Is this Lots Truman's of, dad? Uh, broken things. Ow! Hey, your nephew, Truman. I understand now. On a to put I thought Robert I thought Bob was Truman. I was confused earlier. And Helmet Colbear. Stop it! Right now! I don't want to hear any of those names ever again, you hear me? They're all... lost... dead. But... Bob... Especially that one! Uh, uh, Ow! You're lucky I'm wearing a helmet.
Hello, Mr. Vine. Huh? Vine? Nice vine. Do you think Bob would mind if I took a look inside his mind? Inside the mind of Bob. I guess that works. Yeah, as I said earlier, I was getting very confused between Bob Zanato and Truman Zanato, but now I understand they are not the same person. Which is why Helmut Hello? wasn't hanging around near the nephew Agent of his Zanato? boyfriend. <laughs> it explains a lot now. <laughs> uh, we've only gone 41 minutes, but I feel like this is probably a pretty good wrapping up spot. We're clearly about to do another mine dungeon, and I don't want to get too in the weeds with that. So, yeah, we'll stop here. Uh, last video went long anyway, so this makes up for it. I'll uh, see you guys next time.